So hello everybody, in today's video I'm going to show you how to create this heat map using Charticulator. So are you ready? First of all, Charticulator is a um, tool developed by Microsoft that is completely free and you are going to get the file that I'm using here on the chart at Kerbal Download Center, um, not in community, no, Charticulator downloads. So we're going to grab this file, done. And what we're going to do, the first thing is plot the axis. So we want to have the dates in here, and then we're going to want to have the region in here. This is basically the, um, the structure of the chart. And then as a unit here, or they call it marks in chart calculator, we're going to have a rectangle. Now, to color this, we don't want to have any values on the on the width or on the height. We just want to color that. So to do that, we just drop the new cases in here to um, to the field, and we just color that with the spectral. As you can see, very 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 easy to see. You make this a little smaller so it fits. If you want to have a space in between, just do this a little bit smaller. And then you will start seeing white spaces if you prefer to see a more definite line between the dates. So this is a very way, good way to visualize um, things that happen over time if you have a lot of data points. So you can make this with all the countries. This is the new cases, the corona cases uh, by country region since uh, 24th of March. So once you have that, you can save it. And you can save it uh, into your charts here in Charticulator, or you can export it as an image, HTML code, as a Charticulator template, or as a Power BI custom visual. Okay, what you are going to get from me is a dot chart that you can import here in Charticulator and modify as you like. So, this is how you create a heat map very, very quickly using Charticulator. I hope this was useful, and I'll see you again in the next video. Until then, bye bye.